crazy about Nitsky once she gets shot with one of these. Those are really Cupid's arrows? Shh. You're not supposed to have these. I grabbed them while he was on his potty chair. <laughs> <sighs> Boy, they childproof everything these days. Yeah, but this is great, man. Yeah. Let's celebrate. <laughs> I guess I blew my budget. Well, Mr. Bo Chi Min, where's your aunt? The Joan Baez concert? Uh, I don't know. Let me see. Hey, Aunt Pam, Mr. Nitsky's out here. He really wants to say hi. I do not. You lie like a Democrat sneaking through another entitlement program. Okay, you ready? Don't worry. I know everything there is to know about billiards. But that's pool. Shh. Here she comes. Aunt Pam in the side pocket. You hit my mom. I'll have to take a mulligan. Let's go. Oh, hi, Mr. Nitsky. You're looking very handsome today. Well, yes, I switched to Vitalis from the generic brand. Well, if it isn't Richard M. Nitsky. Okay, well, don't waste this time. Don't worry. She's locked, loaded, and in my sights. Oh, Mr. Nitsky. Well, you hit my sister. Mistakes, I made a few. Don't worry. I'll get Aunt Pam. Mr. Nitsky, did anyone ever tell you you have the cutest knees? <laughs> hey, I saw him first. Are you two nuts? This man is the most reactionary, loathsome, vile. <laughs> Huck a he-man ever to come down the pike. What's going on here? Mr. Nitsky, how would you like to give me a driving lesson? Or me. We could drive to, let's say, the... Reagan Library? I am really mad at you. No problem. Don't even think about it. <laughs> Mr. Bungle didn't keep his hands at 10 and 2 on the steering wheel and died in an inferno of twisted metal. Yeah. 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 Hey. What is wrong with you people? You're not supposed to be cheering. I think your movie set desensitized us to violence. What are you gonna dance to the Halloween wear? Don't go back. Just pretend that's what you meant to say. Steve, isn't that your mom? Oh, yeah, it is. Mom, what are you doing here? Oh, hi, honey. I brought you your lunch. Lunch was two hours ago. Oh, so it was. <laughs> Mr. Nitsky. I didn't expect to find you here. Well, it, it is the driver's ed class. Well, I am the driver's ed instructor. Of course. <laughs> well, you drive me crazy. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> knock, knock. Isn't that your aunt? Oh, I hope not. Hey, Steve. <laughs> I was in the neighborhood, so I thought I'd bring you your mail. And I even slipped in a copy of Guns and Ammo. Did you find out anything about those arrows? The bad news is there isn't an antidote. That's the good news. Just because there's bad news doesn't mean there's good news. Ladies, please, what will the children think? I think it's cool. Well, I don't care what you think. <laughs> Costume. Yeah. Who are you? Bob Marley? Oh, Jessica's going as Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz, and I'm the Scarecrow. Wow, you're doing an excellent job. I don't see any crows in the living room. Man, quit joking around, okay? I mean, every woman in this house loves Nitsky. He could be my new dad. Ew. Or uncle. Ew. Or brother-in-law. Might I add? Ew! Well? What do you think? Meow. <laughs> Don't you think you're a little overdressed for handing out Halloween candy? No, no, I'm driving with you to the dance. Mr. Nitsky's gonna be chaperoning. <laughs> I thought Aunt Pam was driving with me. I am. 
spent the last two hours shoving myself into a saran wrap suit. Well, I do declare, we should be departing from the ball. We can't keep that nice, Mr. Nitsky, waiting. 